not sure where to start. Today, we're talking all about the different types of fitness activities you can explore with Beaumont Health Club. I'm Michelle Everly, the digital marketing strategist for the Rochester Regional Chamber of Commerce. We all know it has been such a difficult season for our local businesses and our community. As we begin 2021, we want to be a part of the recovery and healing process by helping our business community recover economically and our community recover mentally, emotionally, and physically. Today, I'm with Nathan Adams, General Manager at Beaumont Health Club here on South Boulevard in Rochester Hills. Nathan, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having us. How long has Beaumont Health Club been here? So we were formerly uh, Solo Life and Fitness, opened up in February of 2011. Uh, in 2018, we decided to convert over to Beaumont Health Club, still owned by Beaumont, just changed the name. Awesome. So uh, what makes Beaumont Health Club unique? Well, we're, we're a medical-based health club, but we are open to the communities. We're open to the Beaumont employees, obviously their patients. But I think what makes us uh, unique is that we, we try to provide a positive ecosystem of um, where people are able to move freely and uh, allow for social support and in all different types of settings. We have an aquatic area with uh, three bodies of water, including a therapy pool, a lap pool, and obviously a hot tub. And then we have an indoor cushion track, along with many studios for classes and a fitness floor. Uh, we have a field that has turf to do, do some mobility and functional training. And then we try to support that ecosystem with many coaches. We have nutrition coaches to learn about nutrition. Obviously we have fitness coaches that can teach you about movement. And then we have swim lesson coaches and so forth. So we just want to make sure that when you are here, you're supported and you know how to do it correctly and that you're enjoying it. Awesome. Thank you so much. And so I understand you're going to take us around and show us some of the great things. What are some of the things we'll be seeing today? Well, today you'll be on the floor and you'll be with our mobility therapist, uh, Colin Parks. And then also we'll uh, be with a Pilates coach, Connie Meelan. Um, so those are a couple services that we provide and, and the coaches behind those services. Awesome. Well, let's head over and we're going to uh, check out those different services they offer. Thank you. Cool. Hello, my name is Colin Parks. I'm a mobility specialist here at the Beaumont Health Club. And um, our mobility therapy is something very unique that we offer here at the Beaumont Health Club. You won't find it at too many other clubs, you know, within the area, especially in Michigan. So um, today I'm going to demonstrate a few um, movements to help um, Christine here um, increase some range of motion in her knee flexion after ongoing a knee surgery. So we're going to um, first start off with a little bit of massage, myofascial release, um, kind of alleviate some of that tension within her quad muscle. And I'm just gonna simply use a foam roller while I'm doing this, okay? So initially what I'm doing is filling out where there are some tight spots at in this muscle group um, and really kind of using those as well. So this is a very basic and simple way to kind of alleviate that muscle tension in your quads and this is absolutely something that you can practice on your own too but it's a little bit better if you can have someone else working on it for you um, so now we're also going to do some trigger point release so we're going to kind of feel a fill out for those tight spots in our quads all right and when i give you the signal i'm gonna have you um extend and then relax your leg okay mm -hmm. so i want you to go ahead and extend your leg completely and let it come down relax all the way excellent good so now that we kind of broke down or released some of those tight muscle tissues some of those knots i'm going to have christine roll over to her stomach and we're going to work on some stretches for her quad muscles now that good there stretch yep. all right i want you to push against me push 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 and relax Great job. We're gonna do that two more times. Push and relax. Good, one more time. Push, push, push and relax. Good. Take a deep breath. One more deep breath. 
you got a cramp <laughs> where we're at right in the hamstring okay so <laughs> we'll work with that a little bit just to reduce that tightness or make sure that doesn't come back because those things happen <laughs> <laughs> Couple deep breaths for me. One more. Excellent. So now we can feel the stretch a little bit more higher up the leg instead of closer towards the knee. Alright, so all I want you to do is take a deep breath in and when you exhale, drop the hips into the table. There we go. Deep breaths, relax. And continue to let those hips sink down, okay? Good. Two more, big deep breaths. One more. Good, and relax. Excellent. You can go ahead and roll over on your back again. Good. So these are um, just a few stretches that we do for knee flexion, but there's a ton of different um, problems or issues that people may be suffering from, whether it's lower back tightness, hip tightness, or some people who just want to improve their range of motion and flexibility. They might not be in any pain at all, but they still want to improve their strength gain, their blood circulation, or even improve sleep. Um, so it's not only for people who have injuries or are going into surgery or, are, or who's recovering from surgery, but just the general population, people who just wanna improve their flexibility and feel a lot better when they're moving on, their, on a day-to-day -day basis, whether that's walking at home, doing you know chores, or at the gym doing exercises. Well, hello, my name is Connie Milland. I'm a certified uh, Pilates instructor, and I have uh, um, Rose. She's one of um, the members at Beaumont Health Club. She's a beautiful member, one of our special members, and she, I have her on the reformer today. The reformer, I'm working with her in more of a rehabilitation approach to bring correct imbalances in her body and to make her stronger, move from her center, and to help her a more of a beautiful lady. So we are gonna begin, this is called footwork. I have her laying on the carriage, her heels are on the foot bar. We we'll wanna correct her alignment, that's why I have this little blue ball. So I'm gonna place the ball in between her knees. Set her up in a nice alignment, arms to the side. Take a nice big inhale through your nose, Rose, and as you exhale, energy through the heels, press the carriage out. In this position, it's bringing her body, that's good, into more of a neutral alignment. We're correcting uh, lateral rotation in her body. So exhale as you press out. Inhale to return, good. Because I'm working her in a more rehabilitation approach, the exercises would be different than if I worked with somebody in more of an athletic conditioning. I work with the trainers, I work with the professional people, and I would make them a little more active we have different exercises that we would incorporate with them. That's one of the beauties of Pilates, it's a big range of the exercises to work with different formats with people. But Rose is a beautiful client, look at her, she moves so smoothly. How does this feel, Rose? It's fine. Good. Because she's on the reformer, she's supported. So that brings the body into a natural alignment. And as uh, more advanced clients, I would have them doing their exercise standing, sitting, sometimes upside down. Uh, we just have a lot of fun. So we, it, it's exciting, it's fun. That's the intention of the tower back there. We do exercises from the tower, from the reformer, and there's a large variety. Okay, Nathan, that was amazing. I, I didn't know there were so many things you could do here. So. If someone wants to join or just is interested in learning more about Beaumont Health Club, what are the next steps for them? Yeah, so there's probably three different ways. You can go to our uh, website at BeaumontHealthClub.com to see all the amenities and services and also gives you some visual aspects of what the club looks like. Uh, we also have an app. You can download Beaumont Health Club app. Um, that'll provide you with um, some challenges. It also has all the classes that we offer here at the club. It also has our virtual uh, platform called Empower. 
So you can take a look at that. And we offer free trials in all those programs and services. And then the third thing is do just visit us. Drop by and if you want to take a tour, you can. If you just want to come in and swim on your own to just see if it's of any value to you, you can do that too. Yeah, I highly recommend the tour. I've never been here and this is my first time and I am just so amazed and impressed by all the different little things you have going on, the different workstations and pods from the studios to the, um, to the swimming pools and stuff like that. It's just amazing what you have in this building. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, so thank you so much for joining us today, Nathan, and for sharing all about Beaumont Health Club. We really appreciate it. Awesome. Follow us on social media and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss another Wellness Wednesday video. We'll continue highlighting our amazing local businesses that can help you de-stress, get healthy, and build a resilient life.